Read the lads, we are here for episode 12 of the Newcastle United career mode. But let me just record one the other day. We're straight into it now and we're going to get straight into it like I've just said. So, looking at transfers, as you can see, there's Dan Burn. He's just joined Southampton uh, for next season. But, transfers coming in. Um, I read the comments, so some good comments on the video. I really do appreciate you commenting on the last video and suggesting who I should sign. There was a couple of comments about Jonathan David. I think that's a really good um, option. I'll put the comments on the, on the screen now. Thank you for commenting about Jonathan David. I think it's probably too... I think the money that we've got isn't quite there. But I think definitely for next um, next season, back-up striker. Because sometimes I feel like in game, I can't bring Wilton on because he's not great. But he, he can still do a job when needed. Um, but I think Isaac's um, number two needs to be a lot better than Callum Wilson, so I think Jonathan David is a good option. And uh, there was a comment as well about um, Ian Manson, and I think that's the player who I'm going to try and go for now before the game versus Bournemouth. You can see him there, obviously, like I mentioned before, we we asked the Villa of signing Alfonso Davis and Adam at Mad. He's not going to play. Alfonso Davis is going to play for Villa. I think it could be a good move for, for us. We should get it for around 31 million, and I think that's probably around what we've got. So it's going to be a tight one. Might have to offer a player. We'll have to wait and see. We're going to go in for Iamante. It will be a tough deal to try and sort out. As it, oh, we've already got 23 million. We're going to have to offer a player. One player we could offer, it could be Wilton. We could offer them Wilton. Obviously, he was linked with Villa before we uh, signed him. See if we were to offer. Reach, we're going to try this. 20 million. Plus Callum Wilson. Let's see if it's going to get accepted. I really don't know if it will. They don't want Wilson and they want 37 million. That would absolutely take us way over our budget. Any of our players we can offer, Jacob Murray's not going to be enough value. Do we want to get it, give it a Fabian Shaw? It's going to be a tough deal to get this. Joe Willock potentially 15 million. Plus the 20 million that we're offered. Obviously I'd rather long stuff but Willock's... Ugh. I'll try Joe Willock. Pose new transfer fee. And we'll offer 20 million plus Joe Willock. I don't think it will get accepted. If not, it'll be really tough to get any deal done before um, the window ends. Joe Willock... Plus 20 million. Oh, they've upset it. Is. Interesting. So, we may lose Joe Willock to Aston Villa. But, with our midfield free, it's not the end of the world. We need to try and get this um, negotiation done with the contracts. Because I don't know how much money I've actually got. I'll give him important, definitely. Four year contract. I think this will take us completely way over our, bud our, our budget. So... If we were to sign Ian Manson, I think he'll be the only player we'll sign unless we sell someone. If we were to offer everything that we can, so say if we were to give 90 grand, is that enough? Ian Manson is in. Very happy with that. New left back in the team. I am not going to complain about that. Obviously, it's a shame the fact that we've had to sell Joe Willock, but I think... In the long term, I think that's a sound deal. I, I, I never get these price ratings on um, on FIFA, but it's a shame to lose Joe Willock, but we've signed a very good left-back in Ian Manton, who will start the next game. I'm very happy with that league. Right then, Bournemouth at home. They're sitting 17th in the league, so this should be a win. Ian Manton's going to make his debut. The centre-back fitness has always been an issue, and I don't know why that is, so hopefully the fitness can be sorted out, because even more well, has got less than Botman, so it's like... I don't know what the crack is there, like, but I've checked all the stuff on the um, on the tactics bit or whatever it is. I've checked them out, they're all on balance, so the fitness should be okay, considering everyone else is okay. But let's get to it now, boys. Bournemouth at home should win this game. If I'm going to be good at FIFA, let's wait and see. Bournemouth at home, it's got to be a win. Come on, the boys. Alexander Rizak, he just scores goals every single game game 28 goals in 22 games in the Gallagher Strawby corner I'll be celebrating there if that happens in real life what a finish that is came on Isaac oh 2-0 Alexander Isaac is just too good it is too 
too good. He just scores goals whenever he wants. Honestly, like, I'm actually intrigued to see what happens in the summer. Like, are, are Real Madrid going to put in a big bid for him? Like, what's going to happen? 20, is that his 29th goal? Like, he's just, he's, he's too good. He is too good. Come on. Half time. Really good off that like. For once, I've actually feel like I've dominated the game. I, I know what I think Wolves in the last episode we, we battered them, but like they actually had some chances where Bournemouth have done absolutely nothing. Like they've done nothing all game. Had one chance where Nick Pope had a comfortable save. Uh, I don't want Botman's fitness to go down. I caught him the last game or so I actually might even though Dan Burns gonna be leaving the club or a free transfer, I might want whack Dan Burn on to, uh, towards the start of the second half like because the fitness is not great. Oh and Bremo straight from half time. Look at the pace on the boy. Bruno! 3-0. Like that. Lads, I, I am not going to ultimate. Abs I think what what it generally is, it's like when you play squad battles on like on um on FIFA. When you play like a bad team on squad battles, I beat them on legendary comfortably. But then sometimes I'll struggle if it's like against a good team. Like Bournemouth are 17 in the league, I haven't got a great team. Bruno getting a goal, he doesn't normally score. 3-0 just after half time as well. Oh my god, they've scored an overhead kick. How has Nick Pope let that in? No way. Like, uh, mad, mad little goal. It, it was it, Fabian Shaw? Sh sh no, was, no one was on him. Nick Pope should save that. Like, his clean sheet's gone. Good ball in by Trippier. Oh, what a save. Nelly for his ass hat, hat trick, that. Probably Joe Linton on the bullet header. Like always. Oh, they were gone. Corners are just so OP when you've got Joe Linton in the box. It's 4-1. That should be game set done. Anytime, anytime I get a corner on this career mode, Joe Linton's head gets on it. That that should be game set. 4-1. Happy days. Oh, they scored. I don't know who scored that. Like, outstrength Fabian Shaw and just stuck it on the top. Is that... Oh, it's Tavernier. Oh, boy. Look, get lucky get that goal with Joe Linton. Probably he's... Secure the game, but... And there we go. 4-2 win. Good win, that, like... Should be beating teams like Bournemouth for eight in the Kremlin with the sitting 17th. Longstaff win. The on band after bringing off Bruno. Bloody hell, did it? Ipswich... Uh, is that Man City's first loss of the season? Against Ipswich? Bloody hell, this is the... The stumble of City now. We're coming for this league title. Nah, but... Mad that, like... That, that's their first defeat, and it's against Ipswich. I swear Ipswich are bottom of the league as well. Come on, good stuff. Read that another game now. Southampton away. Um, should be a game we win. They're sitting 19th in the Premier League table. So if we quickly look down the bottom of the table um, before we start the game, obviously we've just played um, Bournemouth who are sitting down there. Like, look, we're three points behind Liverpool. Um, in this episode as well, there'll be three games because I need to do the objective on, on um, for XP and stuff. But I will be playing an extra game. So you can see we're, we're, we're doing well. We're doing really, really well. Our goal difference is quite good as well. Obviously, we've scored the most goals in the league. If we go down to the bottom of the league, uh, you won't be able to see the points because of the webcam, but Southampton have won two games this season. Leicester bottom. Patricia are doing well now. They're 50. I swear when we played them, they were in the relegation zone, but Southampton away should be a, should be a win. Obviously, what happened at home um, in real life. Madness, but should win. Let's get into it. Oh, it's been snowing. It's been snowing towards the end of January. Southampton away. It's got to be in a whole win, boys. Oh, Isaac. You can do it in the snow. You can do it in the rain. Oh, it's a good save. Rebound. Come on. Do love a rebound goal. Embremo on the goal. With a goal. Man playing in the snow. Like, it is mad. It feels for a weird, but not going to complain. Isaac can do it in the snow. Should have probably finished it, but good save. Embremo scores. Key man. I knew they were going to do that. Oh, they've scored. I knew they were going to do that pass. Ah, I should have maybe picked the white kick. Because honestly, the little splodges of white on the pitch, it makes it in front of No good, but oh, they've, they've scored. Oh, where are the options? There he is. He's arc. Oh, no. What a finish that is. No, this, 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 is, this is broken. 30 goals in January. What? Like, like I such a good finish. Like the the step overs, then to hit that right in the top corner. Oh, this this card's a cheat code. It really is. Half time. I mean, we're winning. 
Um, it's been a bit of an interesting game, like, yet again, like the other game, I think Southampton haven't really done much, but we just need to take a chance in the second half, and if we get another goal, should be our week, but let's see what we can do. No, no, it won't let us change player. It wouldn't let us change player. Oh, man. It wouldn't let us change player to the one I wanted. 2-2, two, two, man. Game we can't be losing if we want to be getting top four, like... I just, I, oh, everyone just froze. No one, oh, I don't know if it's got a spamming LB or not, but go on, Gordon, go to how are you? Go on, Gordon, you beat them for pace. Come on, back in the lead. I was seen before. Anthony Gordon has done nothing in this game, and he gets the goal to get us back in front, three two. Oh, thank God for that. We've made no subs yet. I think I'm gonna definitely make some subs. 3-2. Oh, Back in the lead. Come on. Yeah, we're gone. Look at that. Little bit of a spin. Game set done, surely. Alexander Rizak. 4-2. 2-2 good. Happy days. Should be three points in the bag. Come on. And there we go. Another 4-2 win, actually. Well, obviously, we'll be born with 4-2. We've won 4-2 here. Um, Good win yet again. Really good win. Obviously, it's deadline day now, so we're going to go through all the um, stuff with that. Obviously, yeah, we can't sign anyone. If anyone sells, we'll, um, I'll, I'll see you, or if I'm considering anything. Read to the last hour. We didn't sign anyone, didn't sell anyone. We've got a couple of bids, in, but obviously, they all got rejected. Um, and I was straight in a match day, apparently. Oh, we're up to third in the Premier League, not bad. So, um, normally I do two games. Obviously, we've done a bit of transfer stuff, but for the objective, I need to play a game tonight. To get 1,100 1, XP. So I'm not going to say no to that. Considering I'm nearly, I've nearly got that Adama on all the team. So um, Fulham um, at home. Um, I think the team I'm just going to keep it exactly the same. Tino's went up and rating brilliant stuff. He's now a 79. Um, I'm happy with that. Like, we'll go straight into it. Can we get three wins out of three? Can we make it 4-2 wins in three games? Um, Fulham at home. Come on. Oh, yeah, boys. Uh, what do you want us to do? Like, seriously? Alexander Vizak gets the ball, scores goals. Like, uh, uh, this feels like FIFA 14, a barbo with attribute cards on. It literally feels like I'm playing with a barbo, man. Like, ridiculous. 1 0 after 8 minutes, I think it is. He's just too good. Nah, lads, lads, lads. It's just too easy. It is just too easy. You know what? I, what I've never ever looked at, right? Let's actually look at Alex uh, Isaac's in game stats. Like, it's, they're not even like ridiculous. Like, 87 bees, 86 shooting, 86 dribbling, 75 physical. This card feels ridiculous. Like, mad. What an absolute finish. Travella, OP, 2 0. And that's half time. Isaac double. Has Isaac scored a, two goals in every game in this um in this episode so far? Like we are smashing it. Fulham had a couple of decent chances, but didn't really create much out of them. Should should win this game and I'll should be nine points out of nine in these three games, but we'll have to wait and see. You never know. Oh, Fulham has got a red card. No way. I didn't expect that to be a red league. Shall I just shoot? Sandro Tonali, they've just got a red card. Oh, I was never going to score from there. Oh, the score from the corner. 2-1, they're straight back in it. I've just made loads of substitutes as well. Like, the whole forward line's changed, long staff's on. Uh, just because we've got that game versus Liverpool in the next episode. More gay should do better there, like I've got to say. Hooray, referee. Oh my god, it's a second red card for Fulham. A second red card? That, I'm, I'm sorry, I don't think that's a red mate, like. I mean, he's, he's came in from behind. Fulham are down to nine men? Surely, surely we can't bottle this. And I've just said, I've just said, literally said we can't bottle this. I've just said we can't bottle it and we just have. I've literally just said we can't bottle the game. They are down to nine men. 
and they've just scored. We're going, oh my, what on earth? Got a Wilson. Oh, how's that not gone in? No way. How's that not gone in? Still on her way. Look at all the space, Harvey Barnes. Get in! Oh my god. 3 2. Pfft, what an absolute bit of madness. Like, honestly. If we were to lose this. They're down to nine men. Like, nine men. Like, all the space there, Harvey Barnes couldn't miss. Come on. Oh, Longstaff, come on, another 4-2, no way man, and Longstaff's got the, the, the captain's armband again, it's 4-2, obviously the, the, the nine men's massively helped with them, of score, look at Eddie Hogg, why, why the, because it, it was in the opposite corner, why is the fuck's the gaffer there, that should be it, 4-2 in every game so far this episode, Longstaff scores, oh no, they're going to score, they have scored. Luckily, Longstaff scored. It's 4 3. Thank God Longstaff scored, because if not, I don't even fucking cry myself to fucking sleep tonight. Reach. Pass the ball about, and we'll get there. Hey, ref. How are you? Come on. Not every game was 4 4 2. N no, it wasn't. So, at least it's a bit of a change. 9 points out of 9. I think that's absolutely fantastic. Yet again, loads of goals. Harvey Barnes and Longstaff saves it towards the end. Thank God for that, man. Big, big win. Let's, uh, let's end off the episode by looking at the league table. Wow. Looking at the Premier League table. We are four points off top of the league. Like, if we didn't give away that daft, daft point against Spurs, we would have been um, second on goal difference because obviously we would have conceded one less and we've scored way more than Liverpool. We're doing really well. We're doing really, really well. We're in the top four by a little bit now. We've set like, a bit of a margin. Eight points. It's going good, but obviously it's a, it's a long way to go. Next episode, we've got that game versus Liverpool, as we can see there. Obviously, the first game we've got to be 3-1, so we're going to have to wait and see what we can do. Been a long one, boys. It probably will be a long episode. I've been recording for a while. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you all in the next one. Yeah, 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 yeah.